The Belgian Armed Forces have served as Belgium's national military since 1830. Over the years, they have fought in World War I, World War II, Cold War, and many other conflicts. But is the Belgian Army still relevant today? What are the most powerful military vehicles in their arsenal? And can they stand up to the world's most advanced nations? Well, today we'll find out together as we explore the top 10 most powerful military vehicles of the Belgian Armed Forces. In this ranking, we'll focus solely on land vehicles, leaving warships and aircraft for future content. And now, let's dive into military technology. Oh, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Ready? Let's go! Number 10. Oshkosh CLV Falcon The CLV Falcon, known globally as the Joint Light Tactical Vehicle, is a robust military vehicle designed to replace older models like the LMV Lynx, which faced reliability issues over time. Originating from a U.S. program aimed at upgrading the Humvee fleet, the JLTV offers enhanced survivability and greater payload capacity. Belgium's military has received 5 out of 322 ordered Falcons, customizing them to meet specific requirements, such as integrating French radios for compatibility with future Franco-Belgian projects and modifying headlights and engines to align with European regulations. The JLTV represents a significant upgrade in mobility and protection for Belgian forces. Number 9. Pandur I The Pandur I, an armored personnel carrier produced by Austria and Belgium, has been a staple in military operations with 52 units currently in service. Developed in the 1980s by Steyr Daimler Puck and later integrated into General Dynamics European land systems, this vehicle has undergone significant upgrades. Between 1996 and 1998, Belgium built 60 Pandurmoren units under license, which included various configurations such as reconnaissance, ambulance, and maintenance variants. To extend its service life until 2035, 44 of these vehicles received a midlife update, enhancing their ballistic armor, mine protection, and engine performance. Additionally, they were fitted with a 12.7mm remote weapon station and slat armor. Notably, some Pandurs are equipped with diverse weapon systems, from heavy machine guns to autocannons and grenade launchers, demonstrating its versatility and adaptability in the field. Number 8. SoFrame HRV The SoFrame HRV, an armored recovery vehicle produced in France, is designed for heavy-duty tasks such as towing, lifting, and evacuating military vehicles. Based on a robust Mercedes 8R8 chassis, the HRV can tow vehicles up to 44 tons and lift up to 32 tons, making it an essential asset for battlefield recovery operations. It has a range of 600 miles, ensuring it can operate over long distances without refueling. The HRV emphasizes crew safety, featuring a pressurized cabin with level 2 ballistic protection. Additionally, it is equipped with a remote weapon station armed with a 7.62 mm machine gun for close self-defense. Belgium has ordered 28 HRVs, including 15 Taurus combat recovery vehicles and 13 Aorus protected recovery vehicles. So far, eight Taurus units have been delivered, with the Aorus variants yet to arrive. Number 7. Leguan The Leguan is a German-produced armored vehicle launch bridge, renowned for its ability to deploy bridges quickly and efficiently in challenging conditions. Initially, Belgium had nine of these units in service, and they remain in use as of 2021 with the 11th Engineer Battalion. The Leguan system has been adopted by 19 armed forces worldwide due to its exceptional performance and ease of use. In 2023, an international Leguan club was established to facilitate cost sharing and support the system's longevity among users. Beyond the vehicles, KNDS, the system's developer, offers a comprehensive range of accessories and support services, including training courses, tools, and bridge supply systems, ensuring that the Leguan remains versatile and effective for decades to come. Number 6. Piranha DF-30 The Piranha 3C Direct Fire Support DF-30 is a key asset in the Belgian Army. Derived from the versatile Swiss MOAG, Piranha 3IC-8088 Armored Personnel Carrier Family, 
With approximately 32 units currently in service, the DF-30 is part of a broader fleet that Belgium began acquiring in 2006, ordering 242 Piranha the through IC variants. Among these, 40 were fitted with CMI Defense 90mm turrets, known as the DF-90, while some also feature the advanced Elbit or CWS-30 remote weapon station. The DF-30 is designed to provide direct fire support to other Piranha the through IC vehicles, emphasizing a combination of speed, deployability, and maneuverability. This makes it a highly effective tool in modern combat scenarios where agility and rapid response are crucial. The primary mission of the DF-30 within the Belgian Army is to support infantry operations and conduct reconnaissance. It is particularly effective against light-armored and unarmored vehicles, as well as in engaging buildings, fortifications, and enemy infantry. Number 5. Piranha DF-90 The Piranha 3C Direct Fire Support DF-90 is a specialized variant of the Swiss-made MOAG Piranha 3IC 88X8 armored personnel carrier, with 18 units currently in service with the Belgian Army. Part of a broader order placed in 2006 for 242 Piranha 3C variants, 40 of these vehicles were equipped with a 90mm turret by CMI Defense, giving rise to the DF-90 model. The DF-90 is designed to provide direct fire support to other Piranha through IC vehicles, with a focus on speed, deployability, and maneuverability. Its primary role in the Belgian Army is to support infantry operations, effectively engaging light-armored vehicles, unarmored targets, buildings, fortifications, and enemy infantry. However, the 90mm gun, while versatile, lacks the firepower needed to penetrate the armor of modern main battle tanks, which limits its effectiveness in certain combat scenarios. Number 4. EBRC Jaguar the EBRC Jaguar is a cutting-edge armored fighting and reconnaissance vehicle developed in France as part of the EBMR Scorpion program, which aims to modernize military forces with versatile, multi-role vehicles. Belgium has ordered 60 Jaguar EBRCs to replace the aging Piranha, DF-30, and DF-90, with deliveries expected to begin in 2025. These vehicles will be deployed across two battalions, marking a significant upgrade in Belgium's reconnaissance and combat capabilities. The Jaguar EBRC is a 6 Jaguar 6 vehicle designed to excel in reconnaissance and combat roles. It was developed by a consortium of French companies, including Nexter Systems, Renault Trucks Defense, and Thales, under the direction of the French Armament Procurement Agency. The EBRC Jaguar is set to replace several older French Army vehicles, such as the AMX-10RC and ERC-90 Sagai. The French Army has ordered 248 units, with the first deliveries starting in 2020. Number 3. Piranha APC The Piranha 3C Armored Personnel Carrier, produced in Switzerland, is a versatile and highly mobile vehicle with 99 units currently in service with the Belgian Army. This amphibious vehicle, measuring 7.57 meters in length and 2.71 meters in width, has a gross vehicle weight of 18.5 tons. It is powered by a 400 horsepower engine paired with a 7-speed automatic transmission, allowing it to reach the speeds of up to 62 bumps on roads and navigate challenging terrain with ease including gradients up to 60% and fording depths of 4.9 feet. Designed for maximum mobility, the Piranha 3C features modern independent wheel suspension, a tire pressure control system, and a disengageable all-wheel drive, enabling it to perform in difficult environments. It is also capable of swimming at speeds of up to 6.2 km. The vehicle's ballistic and mine protection ensures the safety of the crew, making it a reliable asset in combat situations. Number 2. VBMR Griffin The VBMR Griffin, produced by France, is a versatile six-wheel armored personnel carrier developed by Nexter, Arquis, and Thales. Entering service in 2019, the Griffin is designed to replace the older Piranha and Dingo 2 vehicles, with 382 units currently in service. It comes in various versions to fulfill different roles. The VTT, the Genier variant for combat engineering and recovery, the Ambulance Santé variant for medical evacuation, and the EPC VOA variant for forward observation and command control. 
The Griffin offers standard Stanag 469 Level 4 armor protection, capable of withstanding hits from 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds, 105 mm artillery splinters, and explosive threats such as IEDs and mines. This significant upgrade over previous models greatly enhances crew safety. The vehicle's modular design allows for additional armor upgrades if needed. Number 1. Caesar Ng. The Caesar NG or Camion Equipé d'un Système d'Artillerie New Generation is a French self-propelled artillery system designed to provide advanced firepower and flexibility. Produced by Nexter Systems, the Caesar NG is a 100 mm FIFA Mimium 52 caliber howitzer mounted on a 6 x 6 or 888 truck chassis, enabling it to deliver powerful artillery support while maintaining high mobility. Belgium has 28 Caesar NG units in service with a significant procurement plan in place. In October 2021, the Belgian Ministry of Defense signed a contract for nine additional systems to be delivered by 2027, with an order for 19 more systems confirmed by the Council of Ministers in December 2023. The Belgian artillery units will operate 24 of these systems, with four dedicated to military training. And there you have it, folks. These were the top 10 most powerful military vehicles of the Belgium Army. Do you agree with this list? Let us know in the comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and until next time, keep exploring and keep staying curious.